How are we doing, guys? Kyle said he felt like he had to make it up for you after that Denver game. I, I appreciate that he felt that way because, you know, he definitely that last drive, he's like, hey, uh, you got this play and this play to make it happen, uh, so it's on you now. I said, hey, uh, thank you for the opportunity. Pretty, pretty cool that it would come on a, on a play where you're able to make a run after the catch like you have so many different times this season. Yeah, um, it hasn't really hit me yet, but it's definitely uh, exciting. And, um, I mean, it definitely wasn't just me. You had three quarterbacks throwing the ball. You had you know, our O-line, our you know, just ups and downs throughout the year, guys in and out. But that was just a credit for our team to keep pushing and grinding the whole year no matter what happened. Um, I definitely would have really you know, enjoyed a win today, but this definitely uh, makes it a little bit better. George, did you have a little calculator in your head? Obviously, you're going for the win and all that stuff. Yeah. Put it in your head. Uh, I did not, no. I had uh, you know, my position coach, definitely, and uh, some of the other guys were giving me little updates here and there. So, uh, definitely going to the last drive, I made need nine yards, so uh, make it 15, and I said, hey, I'll just take things on, I guess. Did you know your mom and talk to Kyle? Oh, oh, did she? Apparently. Yeah, apparently. That's, you know, yeah, no, that's my mom, probably. Yeah, she probably sent me, like, an update at halftime, hey, you're 50 yards away. That's, that's just who she is. You can trade your jersey. I refuse to. That's mine. Yeah, that, that one's mine. I actually, uh, I hid that so no one can take it at all. I don't want that Tom Brady thing happening where he got his jersey stolen. So, uh, yeah, no, that's mine. Pretty happy. But if it goes to the hall, you're okay with that? Possibly, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You jumped over a lot of guys on that list today, Tony Gonzalez, and guys like that. Does that mean anything to you? That means everything to me. Those are guys that I've looked up to. Those are guys that I've watched their film countless, uh, countless hours. Just trying to take little tidbit, tidbits from each of their games, um, and the fact that, um, you know, like I said, Coach Shannon gave me the opportunity to get that um, all season long. Uh, I mean, that's a lot on him, and I just appreciate everything. And you know, the fact that uh, you know my name's on that list now with those guys, it uh, it means a lot. Like I said, it hasn't really hit me yet. Um, I'm assuming it will in the next like 10, 15 minutes. Uh, but I, I'm I'm overly happy. You set the bar kind of high for yourself and for everybody else. Other tight ends too, but how how can you? Top this next year. Win more games. Uh, that's all I'm. You know, that's all I'm really concerned about. You know, like I said, I could have zero catches for zero yards. And you win you know, 12 games. I'm happy. As long as I'm playing well, I'm winning games. I'm good. You think the Rams were aware of your record? Felt like it. They were double covering me there last drive. I know. I'm just glad that Nick said, "Hey, I'm going to throw the ball no matter what." And I really appreciate that. Describe that last play a little bit more, George. Exactly. Like, Gone up to the start that way. Uh, the last play? Yeah, how did it open? Actually, it was the wrong personnel, so we had to flip spots at who was used to Y. Um, so I had to run a stick, and you know, I'm just happy the guy who tried to jump it. Uh, Nick threw a perfect ball, and, you know, and I don't know who was on the side, some threw me a decent block, and we just kind of slipped through. And definitely once I felt that guy uh, miss me, I was like, ah, I had the opportunity to go all the way here, and uh, definitely took it. Kyle said you could possibly have a better year next year without the same yardage total. What, what do you think he means by that, and, and how do you think you could improve? Uh, Coach Shanahan does a great job in just challenging us every single day, um, whether it's just on the practice field and the film room. And you know, he just wants us to play our best ball every single day. Practice games doesn't really matter, and you know that's why I actually love about him, uh, just the challenge that he gives us. And uh, I'm just looking forward to playing a lot next year. Two more guys. You obviously stated your admiration for Travis Kelsey. Did, do you have you found out that he broke your Right before you did. Yeah, that's what uh, I think they told me that like third or fourth quarter. They said that he had it and I needed him, uh, like nine yards. And I was like, well, I'll let him have it for a little bit, then I'm going to take it. Do you have any celebration plans? Uh, no, my whole family's in town, so I'm hanging out with them. Sounds fun. And I eat a lot of Chinese food, bro. Well, are you going to do a jersey then? Are you going to frame it? Uh, I'm not telling anybody. It's mine. <laughs> All right. Thanks, George.